It's been a while since I have been here. Finally. I got the living room fixed. Now we have our happy home back. Hello, Maya. Hi Chris, what happened? I don't want to talk about it. But are you ready to get going? I noticed that you want the doctor's appointment. Yes, I am ready to go. You got a new car, Chris. Yeah, my other one broke down. Alright. Ready to go? Yes. So how have things been, Maya? Well, William destroyed the living room, which you already know about, and I finally got it fixed. I hate you, William. Hello, sir. Oh hi Michael. It's been a while since I've seen you. What have you been doing after all this time? Well, I've been doing things with my family. So, that kept me busy. Well, a few weeks ago, your father came in here to grab technological parts for his, what he called, work. Yeah, I don't really want to talk about my dad right now. Michael, are you okay? You seem stressed. Yeah I know sir. Can you tell me what's wrong? I think it will make you feel better if you do. There's been something really off with my dad. Ever since he came back from Dr. Chris's office, he hasn't acted well. What do you mean? And who is Dr. Chris? He's my father's psychologist, and doctor. How long has your dad known him? He's been my dad's psychologist for several years now. But I'm worried, because I hope that my father didn't change it after that appointment. Can you tell me exactly how your father has been acting? Well, every time I go to bed, I hear him groaning in pain in his room, and then just about a week ago, I heard electricity shocking coming from the attic of our house. Then, I heard him last night laughing like crazy. Michael. Did I ever tell you about your father's problems? No, you never ever told me. Can you tell me now? Whenever, I was a doctor. I used to work and provide for your dad, and, over the years, he would complain to me about losing his sanity for absolutely no reason. And, he also complained to me about turning pure blush, and completely purple. What? Yes, and I think that this is making your dad act like how he has been acting. I just want my dad to act normal again. Michael, do you think about talking to this guy, named Chris? No, I don't talk to him. I don't really interact with him, because normally he's very busy and has to attend to patients besides my father. Another problem that I had was that my dad would often scream and say the button over and over again. And that was incredibly annoying. Mr. Fritz, it's just, that my father has never acted like this before. But why would he be losing control? Wait, Michael. I do remember a guy named Chris talking about a man named William. What color clothes did he have on? He was wearing a light blue long sleeve shirt, with a dark blue coat, and beige brownie pants, with yellow shoes. Oh my gosh, that is my dad's psychologist, Dr. Chris. Goodbye Mr. Fritz Smith. Goodbye too. It has been excellent seeing you again. So... Are my test results positive? Yeah, they are fine. But it does look like that you have a little bit of mild bruising. Oh yeah, don't worry about that Chris. I had to move a lot of furniture and I also had to repair the living room, and I bumped myself a few times. Okay, do you by chance remember anything that happened after William came back? William, what the heck is wrong with you? You destroyed our living room, and you nearly set the house on fire. Why are you like this now? Oh, babe. I was just seeing if we had any Matronic parts in the drawers. But yeah, that's all I can really remember. GRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
Animatronic Bodies PMG. Oh my gosh! All the animatronic information and plans. They are all saved in this one file. That's incredible. Spring Lock Suit PMG, scrapped failed animatronic character, Fred Bear JPEG. All the files. They're here. Daddy, what are you doing? Oh, nothing sweetie. I'm just looking at some old memorable animatronic stuff that I planned many years ago. Daddy. I miss Evan. I know honey. I miss him too. He was my son. Well, I guess I going to go play. Bye, daddy. Have fun, honey bunch. <laughs> I miss my precious little baby boy. Evan, you will always be remembered by us. We love you. Michael, once I have gained power, I will make sure that you will pay for what did to your brother. Promise. <laughs> Ha 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 